my hometown here in a small city, city Rivne, West Ukraine, and right now I'm living in the capital. Sasha Alexandrov doesn't even know if his home is still standing in Ukraine right now. We heard that um, there was a really hard fight uh, in this area. As the director of FCA Ukraine, he and 13 other staff members, along with their families, came to the U.S. for a staff conference last month. On the second day of the conference, when we finished the day and we just hanging out together, uh, we saw on the news that uh, Russia started bombed uh, Kyiv and other cities. They all immediately knew they wouldn't be going home anytime soon and have been in constant contact with other FCA staff members and family that find themselves in a war zone. Some of them uh, trying to stay strong. Um, physically, but emotionally they crushed. At FCA headquarters in Kansas City. It was, it was surreal. They've been working to support those still in the country, along with the 30 Ukrainians living here. Part of the battle right now uh, with just, you, you don't know, one, you don't know what's going to happen and you don't know how long it's going to happen. Sasha says they appreciate the outpouring of love and support they've gotten here but also can't wait to go back home. Our heart is there because um, we know uh, that God put in our heart uh, our nation.